Hello guys, tonight I will show you how to create animation using just one modifier which is bend. I'm sure everybody know this modifier and everybody use it somehow but creating animation using it is a little weird or sound weird let's say. But when you see this tutorials I think you will learn something from it. Okay we start. First of all we create a top view plane with any size you want. I prefer always to use like a fixed number, so we start with 400 for that, and let's say 154 width, and as much you increase the length and the width in this tutorial, you get more real animation, let's say 100 for length, because it's like 400 here, we make length segment for 100, and we let's say 30 or something, okay. We are done with designing the plane, let's say, and oops, press escape here, okay. Now, as you know, plane will not render this part and part of it, so we need, like, to have double face or, let's say, almost a box. So we will add, select the plane again, and apply the shell modifier here to get like double face, plain or small box or thin box if we can say but sure we don't need this much of outer amount so let's make it 0.1 I think it's okay I'm trying not to press enter because it's like affect my recording so if you get like noise or something that's because by mistake I press enter anyway okay we finish with plain now let's the view perspective view sure we go to modify and then <coughs> modify this one as you see you have like orange rectangle around this plane now first parameter we need to change which is the angle which we add 1500 1500 we make the amount of it direction we make it 90 and bend axis is y and you get this one, okay? Select Gizmo, and as you see now, you just select and move, you select everything. But if you check limit effect, which is active, and make it 360 on our limit, you see the difference now. We're still in Gizmo under the pin. We move. Sure, it depends on the size of our plane, so we can make it again smaller. But I will keep it like as it is now. Okay. Now we done. <laughs> this is the same figure. Yes. Now we have this animation. So let's make it as an animation. We press Auto key and select the plane frame till 100. And let's make it like this. Okay. And then select Auto key again. Let's play it and see. That's all. Now we finish with creating the animation for using only one modifier, which is then sure if we use box or let's say rectangle and make extrude, we can skip using shell. But in my case, because I'm using plane, we can use shell modifier, and also we can add like a curve smooth or something with a mount one I will not increase it because my laptop is a little slow now so that will give us here as you see it's like this nice angle here for pin modifier and if we increase it more make it two is more better and more better but I think my machine will be slower now but it's okay I will not make a render maybe I pause but I will show you okay everybody that's all I hope you learned something from this tutorial and see you soon with other tutorials. Bye.